Now, if you have long-term health issues or injuries, it will be no stranger to over-the-counter pain medications, but they are not recommended for long-term use. So we're talking today about natural alternatives with naturopath Ben Smythe. Ben, thank you so much for joining us. Thanks, good to be here. Now, why should we be considering natural remedies? Well, it's a good question. So currently, when um, a health issue arises for somebody where there's pain and inflammation involved, often the first choice is to go to the pharmacy to get an over-the-counter pain relief medication in order to, to manage the symptoms. But people don't realise that these medications are only supposed to be used for the short term in order to manage the pain. Um, anything up to about two weeks, anything over this time, you actually run the risk of potentially developing side effects that may be associated with taking these medications long term. So I guess there's a misconception out there that these medications can be taken for long term in order to manage chronic conditions, which is actually not the case. Okay, so we should be looking at natural things to sort of make these, these conditions better in the, in the beginning, shouldn't we? Uh, curcumin, I know that can alleviate pain, can't it? What is it exactly and what should we be taking it for? Okay, well we all know the yellow spice turmeric. Yeah, so I love, I'm a big turmeric fan. Absolutely, so it's used in traditional Indian cooking, such as cooking your curries. In smoothies. Absolutely, you can use it. Yep, absolutely. So uh, the problem with it is that, oh, well, turmeric contains an active ingredient called curcumin. Mm -hmm. So curcumin um, has been sort of studied for the last decade on its ability to manage pain and inflammation in the body. One of the things about it though is it's really difficult to absorb. So a lot of the research goes into forms that are well absorbed and well utilised within the body, making it a really good option for pain management. It's really safe and effective and um, it's also, curcumin is in one of the... Um, sort of an example of one of the many pain reduction uh, products out there at the moment in a new category called nutraceuticals. Oh wow, so if you're running and things it can actually help your joint pain. Absolutely, yes, yes. Um, so in the nutraceutical range you've got um, many products that can be used for managing pain because they have an um, equivalence to pharmaceutical medication without the side effects and the risk factors associated. Um, one of them would be magnesium. So we're all familiar with magnesium. It, yes. it, it re, you know, relaxes muscles, um, reduces cramps, it's antispasmodic. Another one would be boswellia. So boswellia contains an active ingredient um, which targets pain receptors in the, in the body and manages inflammation. And there's also uh, an amino acid called DL-phenylalanine, bit of a mouthful. Okay, um, so <laughs> that one doesn't roll off the tongue. No, at all. <laughs> but this is really interesting because it actually um, enhances the pain reducing hormones within our own brains. So these all together sort of um, provide a, a sort of an option for pain management. Um, and all so natural as well. Yeah. Uh, and so there is a product that actually combines a lot of the, most of these natural useful ingredients. Absolutely. So at Lighthouse we've um, developed the product with Dr. Bob Korish, who's a medical doctor who um, specialises in pain management. The product is called Curcuin. So it contains four ingredients. So you've got your, um, the curcumin that we use in there is 46 times stronger than your standard curcumin, the native form. We've also got the other three ingredients that I mentioned, so your boswellia, your dl phenylalanine, and your magnesium. Okay. So together it makes it a really advanced formula for pain management. And you can actually use this to replace over-the-counter medications for pain. Um, it's safe um, and you know really effective for both chronic and acute conditions. So if you get lots of headaches or something, would this, would this help long term? It potentially can help with headaches, yes. Yeah. Wow, it's certainly not going to be harmful though, is it? Because no. it's all natural ingredients. Yeah. Fabulous. And I know that magnesium is very useful for everything, isn't it? For your brain function. For yeah, for sleep, for relaxation, for um, relaxing the nervous system, yes. Excellent. Well, that's been very useful information. Thank you so much for coming in. No Great problem. advice, Ben. Now, if you think Curcuin might be right for you, drop by to consult with your friendly Health 2000 team or head to the website uh, for more information. And Ben has brought along bottles of Curcuin for everyone in the audience today. Thank you so much. You're welcome.